is easy. Well, so goes the song from Ella Fitzgerald. Hi, I'm Dr. Karen Smith from the California Department of Public Health. I'm the director and state health officer. If you live in or visit California in the summer, if you're out in the heat, you are at risk for health, heat-related dehydration and illness. Even if you're healthy, you're still at risk. California can experience very high temperatures in the summertime, and it can happen almost overnight. Health risks can be extremely magnified in vulnerable populations, including young children, the elderly, people with chronic diseases, those with asthma, pregnant women, people with disabilities, and people who are socially isolated. It can be extremely hot, extremely fast. Protect yourself, your family, and your community from the dangers of extreme heat. Making simple changes can help you stay cool, safe, and healthy. In your body, water is vital. So dehydration be, may be one of the first warning signs of heat-related illness. You may also have muscle cramps. You may feel weak, have a headache, feel a little nauseous. You'll become pale, you'll be fatigued, lightheaded, and dizzy. Here's what I suggest to help keep you safe. Stay cool, stay hydrated, stay informed. To stay cool, the best way to beat the heat is to stay in an air conditioned area. If you don't have an air conditioner, go to a shopping mall or a public building for a few hours. When you take a shower during a drought, make it a short shower, but keep the water cool. If you're outdoors, rest often in a shady area. Plan your outdoor activities, including exercise, before 10 a.m. or in the evening. Choose lightweight, light-colored, loose-fitting clothing. In the hot sun, a wide-brimmed hat will help keep your head cool. Try to avoid the direct sunlight. If you are in the sun, use sunscreen. Sunscreen with a protection factor of 15 or higher and follow package directions. Wear sunglasses that provide 100% UVA and UVB protection. Be sure to pace yourself. If you're not used to working or exercising in hot weather, weather, start slowly. Even simple tasks like gardening or walking can put you at risk. So take frequent, regular breaks. And never, ever leave anyone unattended in a parked car. During the day, temperatures inside a car can rise to levels that can kill in less than 10 minutes. Stay hydrated. Don't wait until you're thirsty. Drink water early. Drink water often. Sports drinks are okay. Energy drinks are okay. But make it simple. Make water your go-to liquid. Eat the right food. Summer fruits and vegetables have moisture that your body needs. Salads will help keep you feeling light and hydrated. And finally, stay informed. Check local news for extreme heat alerts. Learn the symptoms of heat illness and keep an eye on others during a heat wave. Check on your friends, coworkers, and family. If you know someone who's elderly or who has a health condition, check on them twice a day. If you have infants or young children, check on them regularly. This is the Golden State. We're known for our summer fun, but stay cool, stay hydrated, and stay informed. Well, I better get going before it gets too hot.